Adam Cole, baby! Tony sounded so lame saying that. Baby! Tony Schiavone. I take back what I said, sir. You're not lame at all. Adam Cole got the fresh Nikes on. I see you, homie. Sounds like you love Adam Cole and Pittsburgh tonight, right? <laughs> well, I'm about to ruin this man's whole career tonight. Jericho. Yep. But for anybody who's followed my career, they know how much I, I studied and idolized you. Why? I mean, a lot of the foundation of Adam Cole, the pro wrestler, was inspired by Chris Jericho. For God's sakes, my catchphrase was inspired by Chris Jericho. Oh, wow, really? I reading in high school and reading your, your first book, where you talked about traveling the globe and learning all these different styles of wrestling. And I remember saying, someday, I want to be like Chris Jericho. No, you don't. And now, fast forward, and here we are in Pittsburgh, Adam Cole and Chris Jericho in the ring for the first time ever. I think that's pretty damn cool. It is, actually. By the way, I'm just joking about Jericho. I, I still think he's a legend, bro. So, so, Chris, let me just first of all start by saying I do have a ton of respect for you. Who doesn't? However, Jericho's about to ruin his whole career. <laughs> run away. Run away. Don't trust him. And then Cole gets jumped by all the jazz. Yeah, give him a minute. He's about to get rude. Yeah, I'm glad you said those words. Because I, I felt the same. I appreciate that. And, you know, I've been watching a lot of your stuff recently, and I've been thinking a lot about this, and I really want to say from the bottom of my heart that I have absolutely zero respect for you. What'd I tell you? What'd I tell you? Here it comes. Here it comes. He's about to go 2006 Triple H on this guy. Hi, Pot. My name's Kettle. The audacity you showed last week to interrupt my championship celebration to come down and, and, and give your little buddy Keith Lee a handshake, it's unacceptable. It's How? Unacceptable. For a talent as legendary as Chris Jericho, and you're lucky I don't slap your dumb face right here, right now. Bro, you got them spikes sticking out of you. Looking like a porcupine. I was afraid you were going to go this route. I was afraid you were going to say that. Uh, because me and a lot of people here in Pittsburgh, lately we think you've been a real jag off. It ain't just Pittsburgh. Yep. Jack off. J Jack off. Jack off. I said something else. I, I mean, Chris, seriously, how hypocritical can you be? I I'm telling you. you. Yourself with, with your minions, the JAS, who hang on every single word that you say, and they look at you like a god. But speaking of looking, when's the last time you looked yourself in the mirror and asked, who is the real Chris Jericho? And is, is the real Chris Jericho an egomaniac who has a JAS with his matches for him? Yep. Yep. Uh, or is the real Chris Jericho the GOAT? The Demo God? One of the absolute greatest to ever do this. Uh, you know who I think the real Chris Jericho is? Who? I think the real Chris Jericho is an insecure, fickle, stupid idiot. Ooh! And you know what happens to stupid idiots? <laughs> ah, yes. The old phrases of Jericho. Bring him up, man. And you've got it, so now what? I'm gonna let you win the first match, and then you're gonna lose two matches against me. Because my partners will beat you up every week. 
First of all, I am not a jag off. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. <laughs> yes, you are. Second of all, you don't impress me, Cole. So let me say this. You know how the old saying goes, you never want to meet your heroes or your idols. But in this case, that is 100% true. Nice. You don't want to meet me. You don't want to know me. You don't want to have anything to do with me. So if you're smart, you'll turn around and get the hell out of this ring. The ring that Jericho built right here, right effing now. Yeah, save your career. Just walk away, Adam. Save your career, buddy. Man, he got that porcupine jacket. Oh no, I wonder what's going to happen next. Yo, look at that. The Jericho Appreciation Society j jumping him. Oh no, who saw this coming? Wow. Oh no. Oh, Britt Baker. Protecting her, man. That's what I need on my team, bro. That's the woman I need on my team. And, of course, the page and them are right there. Uh, wow. I, I, a genius. Not really. I think these girls... I don't know. Oh no, handcuffs. Wow, who's who saw this coming? Hey, Tony Storm looking good in them jeans. Oh. <coughs> um, who said that? Hmm. Well, hey, security, are you guys available tonight? No? You're going to wait till after the beating already happened? Okay. Bro, they need to work on that security logic, bro. Dang, she look good in them jeans. Girl, watch out. Where's Genuine? <laughs> Is there any more room for me in those jeans? Where's security? In front of her hometown, nonetheless. Yo, this is so uncomfortable to watch. Shut up, Chris. Security. Hello. I swear, if they show up after the beatdown is over, I'm going to laugh so hard. Dang, bro. That's jacked up. But boy, I saw that coming from a mile away. <laughs> 